Everyone is Pitakir and we're gonna talk about the new item we are coming in the next patch. Uh, there is a lot of change actually. In this area you can see the old item and the new one there which are currently on uh, the PBU. Um, for uh, first we're gonna... I only ta took an uh, item which is uh, gonna be playable on Senna. I remove every other item like uh, Moonstone and, and Shield. So first of all, they just up like 5 AD more for Mortal Reminder. I think it doesn't change a lot because Mortal Reminder wasn't that great. Um, I don't think I will build this item even if they up it. Um, for uh, Mo, which is actually super strong, they actually make it uh, cost 100 less gold which is super uh, great i don't know why they did that but okay thanks so mo is more broken and you can play it uh, more uh, in game um phantom da dancer they actually if what they say to um uh yeah it cost uh more now with phantom dancer and they give like 5% attack speed. I mean, Phantom Dancer was actually bad on Senna, and I think it's, uh, I mean, it's a nerf. 200 uh, more gold for like 5 attack speed. Doesn't look that great on, on Senna. I think there's better item because they made like big change on other item. So for the collector, they actually add. 6 lethality and they didn't change uh, the rest of the item it was shit on Senna maybe now with some lethality mm. I don't know, I, I, I still think it will be bad but uh, I think there is maybe build wi where collector can be great because now a lot of item cost more and for uh, Runan Runan, they uh, oh they remove the range champion only, or maybe they didn't add it in the thing. So they add they remove like five attack speed. Item cost two hundred more gold. So they add like uh, a thirty magic damage on it. I, I still think uh, I mean this thing is out uh, uh, attack so it's really good uh, wa if you need wave clear and shit and Senna is not I mean Senna is a support if you play it support if you play it ADC obviously you may go for this item but in the case where you play support nah you don't go for uh, Hurricane and even with the up it costs more now so it's kinda hard to get it as a support Next you have uh, Bloodfirst, uh, so Bloodfirst have more life steal now, but you lose all the shield and you get more attack if you have uh, f uh, more than 50% HP, so it costs a lot, uh, as Senna, I mean the good part with the item was that uh, it gives a shield, so Senna doesn't have a lot of HP, so if you have a shield, it's good. But even with that, it wasn't good, because nobody actually... I mean, strange people actually build it, but it's bad on Senna. And it's really rare for people to actually build it, because yeah, it costs a lot. And it's actually hard to proc life steal when you are not uh, CSing, and uh, to... It only work on champion as support because you you won't farm as uh, as support. So I d I don't think it's uh, gonna be good, and plus the fact it the attack damage increase is on level. It uh, yeah, up on level, which is bad because as support you have uh, the lowest level of the game. So I don't think it will be good, but still it give a lot of AD so. Maybe if it's broken on every ADC, it will be broken on Senna, but I think they will nerf it uh, in this case. Um, next, you have uh, Radiant Virtues. Why do the fuck do I add Radiant Virtues? Because now the item costs 500 less gold. What? 
Why, why, why did they do that? I mean, it's so close to Locket, it's like 400 more gold than Locket, but give like HP, give mythic passive HP, so Senatank might be back with, this, with, with uh, Radian. You can play with Bioterka and uh, maybe Kraken, because Kraken is now a legendary I wish, so uh, later. Uh, yeah, you need some DPS, but and sadly Ginzo is mythic, so you can go Radian and Me and Ginzo at the same time. So yeah, they remove ability ice, but fuck ability ice. They remove some HP, and I don't know if they nerf. Yeah, they nerf the the giddying light thing, and yeah, it it heal less. But actually, the active you don't really care as Senna, it doesn't heal much. But the thing is, the, the stat it gives, maybe it will play ball, but I'm not really sure. I, I will try to cook something, like a, a strange build with Radian, and hopefully I, I can make something. Um, Lord Dominic, they give... Uh, what do they give? Uh, they give bonus, physic, and magical damage. So, I didn't really understand the fuck is this. I mean... Does it actually deal AD and AP damage at the same time? So it's kind of it's new, so I'm not sure about it. But it looked broken. <laughs> Dominic was broken, and now it's more broken because of the giant slayer thing. So yeah, Dominic might be really really strong now, even if he was al already strong. So I might buy it uh, a lot of time. But I have to figure out uh, how they uh, make the thing with uh, bonus physic and magic damage. Does it spin half magic, half AD? And how it uh, works against uh, armor and uh, magic resistance? And next we have uh, attack damage. Uh, Strombizer, you have uh, 10 more damage. Uh, and you have. Uh, you deal. AP damage and have AD ratio and AP ratio and the slow wait and grant move speed. Hmm. Wait, giving move speed to Senna is actually great. Actually, Stromizer doesn't look that bad. I mean, it, co it costs more gold now, so it's kind of bad. It have AP ratio, but. And some, I mean, Ginzo give uh, a AP now, so maybe Ginzo Stormbizer can be a uh, good duo, because it will have a, a strong burst on one auto. I don't know, Stormbizer look to be back in the game. We will see. I, I think he, he can be really strong with uh, Senna. Uh, Maybe, mm, I don't know, M maybe you can replace Rapid Fire with Eclipse because Eclipse is more of a burst build. So if you have uh, Eclipse plus Traumizer and you manage to get a lot of AD, you can actually deal a lot of uh, damage, but y you need way more AD now. Maybe two, uh, uh, I think, yeah, more than, le less than 280 to actually deal more damage with the ball thing because it was uh, uh, 120 and now it's, uh, yeah, y you need, I, I didn't calculate the thing, but yeah, you needed some AD, so that's why I think Eclipse is good because it gives AD and other thing. I don't know if actually Eclipse will st still be the, the best thing to play. Because, I mean, there is a new mythic that, that look really great. Uh, next, Rapid Fire. I think uh, that's a nerf. For me, it's a, it's a nerf for Rapid Fire. I mean, they give a lot of AD. Like, uh, yeah, they add AD. They remove way too much uh, attack speed. And... They let the uh, energize and shard a uh, shooter thing, and sadly the item costs like five 
100 more gold. Maybe rapid fire is dead on Seno because of that. But at least it give AD. So if you combine with uh, Stromizer, it actually can deal tons of damage. Uh, I'm thinking about Ginzu, rapid fire, and Stromizer. These three items maybe together. And maybe with Kraken Slayer and you can uh, deal some huge damage. So about Kraken Slayer, no it doesn't. It's not a, a mythic anymore, it's a legendary item. Um, it's, yeah, it costs less now. Well, uh, for uh, 400 less gold, uh, less attack speed. Uh, less uh, AD, more attack speed, and no, it doesn't do true damage. Okay, that's sad, but it does uh, magic damage and have AP ratio. But I mean, how how you supposed to get AP on Senna when the only f AP item is Kinzo? Because I don't see good AP item. Because it's still uh, Senna is still a champion that is based on o auto, so AP isn't that great. Even if uh, no item have AP ratio, but still AD ratio are uh, stronger. I mean they are bigger uh, per percentage. Uh, well, I think it's the same. First attack, Tarius. Wait. Then trigger on the same target within the increase this damage by Oh the more I mean if you're facing Sion and you manage to get in the six second two times the uh, bring it down thing, you deal more damage like a lot. <laughs> so now if you're f ah, it's still a good item against a uh, uh, strong front lane, because now it deal tons of damage. Um, it's it's magical damage, but at the same time it will do AD and AP, which is kind of great, m less great than true damage, obviously. Uh, in long long fight on the same target if you do front to back it can really deal way too much damage so yeah kraken can be really good with uh, maybe ginzu or radian if imagine you're playing radian you're tanky and so you can deal a lot of damage the sad part is you to deal this damage you can uh, need AD and with Radian, you won't have so much AD, so I don't know. We will see. Um, Gale Force is uh, still a mythic item. They uh, remove some AD, remove uh, some attack speed, add move speed. And change the passive to now it's give uh, AD and no longer move speed. Uh, I still think it's shit on Senna. It deal more damage. No elf target. Elf. Okay, it's uh, oh no, Gale Force is really strong to finish enemy, which can be a problem for Senna. <laughs> okay, this item. Uh, I don't think it's playable on Senna. Cause yeah, it give a dash and thing. Even if ah, move speed is actually something you want on Senna, but it costs as much as Kraken cost before. So yeah, it's it's still the same cost actually. And it scale on the the level, so kind of bad for support. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't know it actually already do that. Okay, uh, and the CD is actually lower and the damage. Yeah, the damage are kind of increased. Maximum is the range in this below. Okay, oh, wow, yeah, okay. 
Um, Immortal Shibo is a legendary item now. It gives. It doesn't give crit anymore and doesn't have mythic pass because it's not mythic anymore. <laughs> uh, it gives shield still. Um, it's uh, less strong than before. And now it's give attack speed. So maybe, maybe in some game when you have some issue. Uh, against burst champion like Renga and shit. Can it save you? I don't think so, but <laughs> you can try. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be so relevant because like uh, the shield. I mean, you can need armor boots and this thing to survive against uh, some assassin. Maybe it can be something, why not? If you're facing AP, you will go more, and if you're facing AD with Rengar and shit, uh, you can go Immortal Shibo because now it costs way less. I think it's a good option against burst enemy who are annoying a burst AD uh, enemy. Um, static, they just uh, brought back static to to the game. It's good uh, to for wave clear. You don't need wave clear. Uh, it's it have a AP ratio, and as I said, it depends on your level. So it's kind of I don't think it will be playable on Senna. Uh, next, you have uh, Navori. Now it's a mythic. It was dog shit for Senna, and it's still dog shit. So <laughs> good. Um, uh, I don't know what to add. I mean, it give us. Uh, it it's not something you want to play on Senna. It's just it's never it. It was bad and it's still bad. Um, I don't know the fuck they make Infinity Edge a mythic, but it's now a mythic. Um, I don't think I will. I don't know. I mean it's a good last item but if you want to do a build with infinity edge as mythic as Senna you can you kinda need to make it in a last or or for uh, first item. I don't know. I don't I, for me it doesn't look that good because it's kinda the same item, it gives like five AD now. I don't know. For me Infinity Edge wasn't that great on Senna, it will be maybe good on... I mean, some champion actually need that item to do something, but Senna it don't need uh, Infinity Edge. There is way better Mythic, like Ginzo. <laughs> so now they make Ginzo a Mythic. It costs a lot, okay. I mean, it costs a Mythic. Uh, it deal 30 magic damage plus your critic, so uh, it's nerfed on Senna. It's maybe I at the end uh, with uh, 100 uh, crits, it will be like uh, 200 plus something, but not 30. Um, it gives uh, ability power. It Senna got AP rate, so even it's not the best thing on her. It gives less attack speed. It have AD now, but the thing is, grant all other legendary item, five armor penetration, six magic penetration. What? It's broken, no? <laughs> <coughs> why? Why do I want to go eclipse when there is the thing? And the problem is, this item is actually way too broken, like way too broken because Katarina and other champion will just be way too strong with this thing and it it's it give uh, attack speed stacking out to fourth time so you get more attack speed than before actually I didn't already it when this will fully stack it and there you have the double and on it effect so fuck the fuck riot I mean no way this thing uh, go out of the PBU without a nerf. It's not possible. This thing is just too broken. Uh, we if it go on live, 
server I will just spam it with Senna first item I don't care this thing this is just too broken um yeah they will nerf it uh, obviously there is no way they will uh, release it like this so now prowler is a legendary item uh, after dashing uh, blinging or e exiting still your next attack on a champion deal additional to 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 is deal if deal by a dominant champion so the only way to proc it is E on Senna is actually bad but it's gonna be an, an issue against Rengar and <laughs> think they're gonna one shot you and throw you to death uh, yeah, Prowler gonna be an issue for Senna not because you I don't think there is a way to build it because yeah, as I said to proc the thing it only work on your E um, Next we have Dustblade, so Dustblade is still a mythic, um, they didn't change much, they uh, changed the Night Stalker thing, now when you you have ability and the target missing it, so you deal more damage with ability which is not something you want with Senna, then you have damage with the Strassian, then you become untargetable. The thing, the, ma the main problem is I don't really understand untargetable what it will really do in the game because there is no ch no, uh, no, no champion that's untargetable. I mean Gwen is when she's in this uh, range thing but still uh, normally uh you can get hit by spell but gwen cannot so it's not the same thing so you will be able to move without being able to be targeted by uh, auto or other thing by target uh, thing and it's kind of like senna e but we people cannot see you even if they come closer i, I think but if you auto or deal damage I I think you spell I don't know if uh, poison will trigger it. You will uh intargetability will uh, go off. Well I don't think it's I mean maybe it's gonna be something if if this break this blade is broken on every champion it will be on Senna but uh, if it's if it's broken every every champion Riot will nerf it obviously <laughs> and not let a uh, broken item like this exist but yeah the, the main problem is still it doesn't give penetration uh, and other thing I mean penetration is the main problem and Ginzu have penetration so I, I Ginzu I want my Ginzu um, Yumagus Blade is now um, mythic, uh, it costs like uh, 100 more gold, uh, uh, it has more ability A, stone AD, uh, now with the active it gain move speed and ghosting for 6 seconds, during this time you should have stack 2 times faster, I mean it, it gives stack and move speed but it's uh, only uh, out of uh, champion combat it gives some lethality but still doesn't look that great on Senna I, I think the, we saw better mythic before that maybe why not it's more speed but the thing is it's more like an assassin thing so it only works out of combat so maybe to initiate fight I mean if I can get a lot of move speed go in Q deal some lethality damage and run out why not? Why not on Senna? It doesn't look that bad. We will see. We will see what is gonna happen. They will nerfing in PB and shit. And I will try to do a, a guide when... Uh, first, uh, before that, I will do gameplay video where I try some build uh, when it comes to life. And after that, a guide when I kind of figure out what uh, item gonna be... It was all for this video. If you have any idea of build and thing, say it in the comment. And see ya!